Has this latest viral TikTok trend taken things too far? The Skull Breaker Challenge is going viral on the internet again, and here's why it's so dangerous. At the start of 2020, the Skull Breaker Challenge took over TikTok. The craze was a serious cause for concern as report after report rolled in of injuries linked to the trend. Now, a year later, the challenge is back. Ice Bucket, Gallon Smash, Kiki and Car Surfing are just some of the crazy challenges that the world has taken part in on social media, but the Skull Breaker Challenge reaches new levels of ridiculousness. There's joining in with the latest craze and then there's risking your own life for some likes. So, what is the Skull Breaker Challenge on TikTok? And why is it so dangerous? Let's find out. What is the TikTok Skull Breaker Challenge? A trend known as the Skull Breaker Challenge is going viral on TikTok again. If you're not familiar with what it is, here's everything you need to know. The Skull Breaker Challenge involves three people who all stand in a line next to one another. Then the middle person is told to jump in the air, and while they're mid-air, the people either side kick out their legs, tripping the middle person up. Normally, the prank ends in the middle person falling backwards onto the floor. Why is the Skull Breaker so dangerous? There's a reason why the trend is called the Skull Breaker Challenge, and its name gives an indication of just how dangerous the challenge really is. Because of the nature of the challenge, it more often than not sees one of its three participants land themselves on the floor. Whether their head, neck or back cushions the landing, well, that's up to chance, but, these young people are being hurled from a standing position to the ground which in many cases has resulted in serious injury. In March 2020, the BBC said that there have been many reports of serious injury from the challenge in Pennsylvania, Oregon, Arkansas and Alabama and reported that, in New Jersey, the Camden County Prosecutor's Office said two children had been charged with third-degree aggravated assault and third-degree endangering an injured victim aft. Er an incident involving the prank. At the time, TikTok told BBC News that there was now text underneath the hashtag hash Skullbreaker Challenge, reminding users to not imitate or encourage public participation in dangerous stunts and or risky behavior that could lead to serious injury or death. When you try and search the hashtag in 2021, it no longer exists on the app and TikTok claims that it does not allow content that encourages or replicates dangerous challenges that might lead to injury. WHO started the trend. The craze is said to have started out in South America. The Indian Express reported in 2020 that, one of the first videos that went viral was shot in a school in Venezuela. However, it's unknown who first came up with the viral challenge. By the looks of things, many authorities all over the globe have already been alerted of the danger that the Skull Breaker Challenge poses, so with any hope, it will stop catching on among teenagers and young people very soon.